Hi everyone, it's Tracy Bowman. It's Bowman for Art on Facebook, TA Bowman Studios from Buzzards Bay. And I just put down my house paint and I spun it out really good. I'm gonna do a flower. And I don't want my flowers to disappear. So I spun it out good. I've got a nice flat surface, good coverage here. And I'm gonna do purple and blue flowers. So, 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 so. I'm gonna determine where my purple flower is going to go. And when I'm doing two, I put them off center of the canvas. I'm gonna do a purple one and a blue one. I've never done this combination before, so I'm excited about that. I'll give you a tiny bit more here, come on. Here we go. All righty, now my leaves. And I've got sap green. doke and I'm going to use I like my leaves to be variegated so I'm going to use um, <laughs> I am going to use a little shocking green this is by color shift deco art color shift and I like the variation in tone dribbling Tracy and I really love a bit of gold in them too leaves have a tendency to turn a little yellow <laughs> all right <clears throat> Pop some bubbles here. I've got my cell activator. I do use Australian Floetrol mixed with Payne's Gray by Amsterdam. And I put my cell activator there so I can blow the leaves out. Touch more, just one drop, there we go. Perfect. All right, and I love this leaf blower. As you can see, I've well used it. <laughs> It works terrific. And the first thing I do is blow out my leaves. So here we go. And I scoot that cell activator right across that color.
Okay. Now we let them sit and kind of percolate. Now, my flowers, I'm going to put just a spot of purple on the blue and just a spot of blue on the purple. Let's see how that goes. <clears throat> and then just a spot of gold. Cell activator. Okay. Now the flower you blow out last will be your most prominent flower. So I want the blue to be the most prominent. We'll start with the purple, and I come from up high, looking to see where my blower is hitting, and I want to catch that bullseye right in the middle. Let me open it up. And then I go to the next one. I hold it here in the middle just a bit. Make sure I get some good cell action. All right. Now, because um, the cell activator is stretchy, we just blew it out. Now we need it to come together. The leaves have sat some, so they are ready for me to play with. Okay, now that I've played with the leaves, I can make my flower petals. So I love these skewers. I use this for the petals and that for the leaves. So, and I'm gonna make this center, my center of my flower. So we bring it in almost to the center, but not quite. And I lift straight up not to dribble.
little detail to the flowers. Okay, now we can spin. I like this color combination. The purple and blue came out lovely. Yes, 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 yes. Very nice. I'm very happy with that. So I get to play and make these little doodad flowers. I'm going to make a couple. make more than a couple. <laughs> Those are the purple ones. And here will be the blue ones. Okay. There. Here we go. How sweet is that? Well, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe and you'll be able to see what comes next. Thank you so much. Bye now. Son of a bitch. Hi everyone. I just thought I'd let you know that the painting is finished. And let me show it to you. And there it is. In all its glory. All done. And it really glistens with the uh, gold in it. It just pops. It's done. Really came out really nice. Really happy with it. So you'll have to try it. Thanks for watching.